just outside Aurangabad at the Sihayajal foothills, paved steps lead up to our next destination. everybody. We are here today at the Aurangabad Caves. These were an important time link between the Ajanta Caves and the Ellora Caves. So they linked up the period from the 1st century to the 7th century of the current era. Let's go and take a look. This Chaitagriya is the only cave of the earlier Hinayana phase. A series of plain octagonal columns pass around the Dagoba at the rear. The austere cylinder of the Dagoba as a bulbous dome with a harmika and inverted pyramid on top. Stone ribs carved out of the vault are an imitation of wooden beams. The soft basalt entrance has collapsed revealing its interior. Cave 3 is the finest of this complex, a vihara but without the individual cells for monks. Salbhanjikas sway from the pillar capitals. Hidden in the dark recesses are devotees hands folded gazes transfixed in adoration through the centuries. Pillars and pilasters are carved with floral and geometric motifs. A flautist, dancing musicians and percussion. Medallions on the shaft show cameos of couples and groups. Cave 2 is a worship hall. Seated on a lotus stool, Buddha's halo reflects golden sunlight. Padmapani, attended by a naga, grasps a lotus stalk with the Buddha at the top and also on his forehead. On the other side, Vajrapani has a lightning bolt in his right hand and a deer on his left shoulder. A production path around the shrine is cut out of the living rock. This circumambulatory feature is borrowed from structural temples. It evolved from the Chaitya Griham in Mahayana Buddhism. The walls are covered with figures of seated Buddhas in various hand gestures. Only the shrine with an image of Buddha exists in Cave 5. The rest of the soft rock has collapsed and crumbled. So this was Aurangabad Caves. And as you can see, this also displayed some of the transition to tantric art forms from the traditional forms of earlier. We hope you liked viewing this with us. Don't forget to like and to subscribe and we'll see you on our next destination.